Did you come across a recipe which demands the use of jelly roll pen? Do you wonder how is it different from a baking sheet? In this article, we will find out what is it exactly. Jelly roll pan is one of the most versatile tools in a cook's arsenal. It is similar to a cookie sheet or baking sheet, but the edges of the pan are raised. Normally, the edges are about an inch high. Apart from baking cookies, it can be used for a variety of purposes. It can be used to roast vegetables as well as for broiling meat. An added advantage is that they are not expensive and also easy to clean. Hence, they are apt for any baking project that you want to undertake. Are you confused and are torn apart between jelly roll pan versus cookie sheet? Well, the main difference between the two is that jelly roll pans have one inch edge. Whereas cookie sheets are flat without any edges. Buying jelly roll pan. When you want to buy this pan, you will decide between the various sizes. The dimensions of this pan are 10 and 1/2 inches x 15 and 1/2 inches x 1 inch, which has volume of 10 cups. The other dimension available is 12 and 1/2 inches x 17 and 1/2 inches x 1 inch. The volume of this pan is about 12 cups. Another size available is 15 inch x 10 inch x 1 inch. You will have to opt for a size, which will suit the size of your oven. You would want to buy a pan, which is relatively heavy for its size, so that the pan can hold and distribute heat to the bottom of whatever you are baking, or roasting. It will also be more durable. There are various types of jelly roll baking pans available. You will have to be the judge of the fact. Which of them suits your needs better? There are the aluminum, stainless steel and not to forget the non-stick jelly roll pan. Different pans have different reviews. Jelly roll pan recipes. There are various recipes, which make use of jelly roll cake pan, but the most popular are the dessert recipes. Homemade granola bars Once you taste these homemade granola bars, you will never go back to the granola bars, that you get in the market. Ingredients required oats 3 and 1 half cups raisins 1 half cup dried cranberries 1 quarter cup dried cherries 1 quarter cup slivered almonds toasted 1 half cup pecans roasted roughly chopped 1 quarter cup walnuts roasted roughly chopped 1 quarter cup honey 1 half cup brown sugar 1 quarter cup egg beaten 1 butter melted 1 quarter cup method in a mixing bowl combine oats raisins cranberries cherries, almonds, walnuts, pecans and brown sugar and mix well. Then add honey and beaten egg to the dry mixture. Grease a jelly roll pan and spread the mixture over it. Press the ingredients down firmly and place the pan in the oven. Bake it bake at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for around 20 to 22 minutes. Let the pan rest on the cooling rack. After it is cooled down, Cut into individual bars and your granola bars are ready. Bacon wrapped fig bacon and the recipe can also be replaced with cottage cheese. So that the recipe becomes suitable for the vegetarians. The vegans can use tofu. Ingredients required Canadian style bacon 12 ounces dried whole figs stem removed 2 packages pistachio nuts 30 fresh basil leaves 30 method heat the oven to 425 degrees Fahrenheit till you do the other preparations. Spray cooking spray on the jelly roll pan. Cut each of the bacon slice into two. Make a slit in each fig and stuff it with nut. Place basil leaf on bacon strip and wrap it around figure place the wrap seam side down in the pan. Bake wrap for about 8 to 10 minutes, till bacon is brown in color. Serve them warm with toothpicks. Jelly roll pans have become more popular. Because food does not slide of these pans, thanks to the edges. Also the oven does not become messy, as there are lesser chances of juices leaking from the pan. At the same time, there is a huge variety of dishes, which you can make in the jelly roll pan and not just coffee cakes and granola bars.